In this video, I will demonstrate how to crop an image or vector artwork using a clipping mask. A clipping mask is the quickest way to crop an image in Illustrator and is non-destructive. Though it isn't the most versatile method, for an extremely simple crop, a clipping mask is perfectly suitable. Here I have a placed photograph. This could also be a copy and pasted image or even pre-existing vector artwork, but for our purposes, we'll use a simple photo. Next, I'll draw a rectangle around the area I want to crop. I'm using a white stroke and no fill so that I can easily see what I'm drawing as well as what I'm cropping. You could also use a circle or a more complex vector shape depending on the form you want the image to take. Select both the image and the shape by clicking the image, holding down shift, and clicking the rectangle, or by drag selecting. To create a clipping mask, Go to Object, Clipping Mask, Make. As you can see, the photo is cropped to the rectangle we just made. You can see that the stroke disappeared automatically, but if you want the stroke, you can easily add it. Now I'd like to show you some of the more in-depth features of a clipping mask. You can see here that the image is still intact. We have not actually lost the section of the image we cropped out. This is a huge benefit as it is non-destructive editing. If you click, then double click on the image, you can move the photo around within the clipping path. If you then click on the path, you can manipulate it without moving the image. If you want to remove the clipping mask, go to Object, Clipping Mask, Release. And that's one quick and easy way to crop an image in Illustrator. For a more versatile method, check out the Cropping with Opacity Masks video.